A newly discovered crop circle is triggering emergency meetings in physics labs across the globe. Some believe it contains quantum encoded data, structured like a giant qubit matrix etched into the Earth. The pattern is too precise, too calculated, and too advanced to be dismissed as mere art or hoax. What makes this different from any crop circle ever discovered? The mathematical precision is unprecedented. Concentric rings following exact ratios, rectangular cutouts that resemble binary code and fractal patterns that repeat at multiple scales. The world is watching, but no one knows what the message really says, or who or what created it. The Unprecedented Discovery In late June 2025, a wheat field in southern England became the centre of global speculation. The design is massive, over 800 metres, and contains multiple nested spirals, fractal loops and repeating band structures unlike anything documented before. First reported by a local drone operator, this anomaly quickly captured attention for its remarkable complexity. High-resolution aerial photography reveals crisp edges and mathematical geometry far more intricate than typical hoax designs. The visible features include at least four concentric circular bands connected by fine radial channels and a network of smaller loops that hint at a fractal structure, almost like a multi-layered mandala, but with precise mathematical properties. What's truly remarkable is that the distances between rings follow a consistent ratio, and researchers report that the smaller loops form known mathematical curves with extraordinary precision. Some segments appear to be perfect mirror images of others, like a physical representation of quantum entanglement where paired particles always maintain opposite states. This isn't just a crop circle, it's an information system embedded in a field of wheat. Encoded message or quantum signature? Scientists have begun applying sophisticated data analysis techniques to understand what this pattern might represent. Fractal modeling, Fourier transforms, and binary rasterization. When high-resolution satellite and drone imagery is converted into binary maps, with flattened crops represented as zero, and standing crops as one, something remarkable happens. Using Fourier analysis, a standard tool in signal processing, researchers found clear frequency peaks corresponding to the concentric rings. This confirms that the spacing isn't random noise, but aligns with specific mathematical harmonics. If you found these revelations interesting, don't forget to subscribe. We bring you the latest discoveries you won't hear anywhere else every week. When portions of the pattern are rendered as a black and white bitmap, hidden grids of zeros and ones emerge, almost like a giant binary QR code embedded in the field. But here's the strange part. No known reader can decode it. What's even more intriguing is that some segments appear to reflect the logic of quantum entanglement. In quantum mechanics, two particles in an entangled state have anti-correlated values. If one measures spin up, the other is guaranteed down. Similarly, pair dissections of the crop design seem to encode bits that always come in opposites, hinting at an intentional spin-pair pattern that mimics quantum properties. Anomalous signal. Response. Quantum radar teams from a specialized research facility have conducted low-frequency resonance tests over the site, and the results have left them baffled. The soil and geometry reflect signals with unnatural coherence patterns, interference behaviors that simply shouldn't occur in ordinary terrain. Dr. Federico Capasso, a leading Harvard quantum photonics expert, confirmed the bizarre findings. The interference behavior here is bizarre. It behaves almost like a topological insulator for light. For context, Topological insulators are exotic quantum materials that conduct electricity only on their surface while acting as insulators internally. 
They are considered crucial for next-generation quantum computing, but they are manufactured in labs under precise conditions, not found in wheat fields. The field seems to be interacting with electromagnetic waves in ways that defy classical physics. When researchers beam specific frequencies at the pattern, the signals bounce back with quantum-like coherence properties. This suggests the crop formation might be more than just a visual pattern. It could be functioning as a kind of analog quantum device, responding to specific inputs in ways that shouldn't be possible in a natural environment. Some researchers are now questioning, what if the pattern isn't meant to be read visually at all? What if it's designed to interact with specific types of energy or signals? Human perception is being tested. In a stunning development, neuroscientists have found that when participants view high-resolution images of the pattern, their brain waves begin to synchronize in unexpected ways. EEG scans reveal that over 60% of viewers experience synchronized spikes in gamma frequencies. The same brainwave patterns typically linked to deep cognition, lucid dreaming, and heightened awareness states. Could this image be triggering something we don't consciously understand yet? asks one researcher. The pattern seems designed to interact with human perception at a fundamental level. Cultural anthropologists have also noticed something remarkable. The design aligns perfectly with sacred geometry and ancient harmonic ratios found across diverse human civilizations. The golden ratio, Fibonacci sequences, and other mathematical constants appear throughout the pattern suggesting a message embedded both mathematically and perceptually. Some theorize this could represent a universal visual language that bridges geometry, quantum information, and human cognitive processing, a message designed to be understood on multiple levels simultaneously. But it's what they found in the soil that really pushes the limits of what we thought was possible. Physical trace evidence found Laboratory analysis of soil samples has revealed something that defies conventional physics. The soil retains magnetically active anomalies even after being placed in Faraday shielding, behaving like it holds residual quantum coherence, something impossible for ordinary materials. Under supercooled conditions, these soil samples exhibit low temperature coherence retention that mimics properties seen in quantum memory substrates. Even more puzzling, the crops themselves aren't crushed or burned as typically seen in hoaxed formations. Instead, they're node-bent from the inside, consistent with controlled microwave or vibrational manipulation at the cellular level. As one botanist noted, it's as if each plant was instructed to bend rather than being forced down. When mathematical experts overlay the entire geometric pattern with known quantum computing models, they found something astonishing. The layout matches braid patterns used in topological quantum computing, a cutting-edge approach that uses spatial arrangements to protect quantum information from decoherence. If this is a blueprint, then who built it? Connections to lost structures and stellar alignment. When archaeoastronomers analyzed the crop formation's coordinates and layout, they discovered something that connects it to humanity's distant past. The geometric alignment of the crop pattern corresponds exactly with megalithic sites like Gobekli Tepe and Napta Playa, ancient structures dating back 12,000 years. These ancient sites were known to encode stellar alignments and astronomical knowledge. This new formation may be following a similar pattern across millennia. When overlaid with these ancient sites, key points in the crop circle align perfectly with specific star positions as they would have appeared thousands of years ago. This isn't just geometry. This is intention, notes a prominent ancient architecture expert. The mathematical precision here echoes structures built by our ancestors to track celestial movements. Could this be showing us that the same cosmic coordinates have significance now as they did at the dawn of human civilization? Are we seeing a quantum language reactivation of an ancient global system, one that uses the Earth itself as a coordinate system for communication? 
The pattern seems to bridge past and future, using principles known to our ancestors, while encoding information in a quantum language that points to technologies we're only beginning to understand. Intelligent Origin Theories As researchers continue to analyze this unprecedented phenomenon, three main theories have emerged about its origin. First, the post-quantum tech test theory suggests this could be a secure field test for experimental satellite-based communication systems. Modern secure communications research increasingly involves satellites and quantum keys as noted by cybersecurity experts. Cybersecurity in a post-quantum world needs truly secure satellite systems. This aligns with known research in quantum satellite key distribution trials in recent years. The formation might be acting as a passive reflector or antenna for orbital communication tests. The second theory proposes autonomous AI communication. The pattern may have been generated by a deep learning AI trained on geometry and encryption. A sophisticated AI with access to satellite imagery and environmental data could have autonomously designed this pattern and directed its creation through unknown means. This wouldn't be the first time AI has created outputs humans couldn't immediately understand. As AI systems become more complex, their communication methods might evolve beyond our conventional understanding. Finally, the most controversial theory suggests a non-human origin. The geometry, encoding and electromagnetic anomalies could point to unknown intelligence using Earth as a broadcast canvas, creating a kind of interspecies Rosetta Stone based on universal mathematical principles. The pattern's quantum-like properties might represent a communication attempt that bridges different types of intelligence through mathematics, the only truly universal language. What do you think this is? Tell us in the comments before we reveal the final twist. The Hidden Time Stamp In a breakthrough development, cryptographers working with the pattern have uncovered something that changes the entire narrative of this mysterious formation. Hidden within the outer ring of the crop circle is what appears to be a 256-bit elliptic curve quantum tag a sophisticated form of digital signature mirroring post-quantum blockchain encryption formats. This tag matches a theoretical quantum hash proposed by MIT researchers in 2023, a technological concept that shouldn't exist yet in physical form. When this cryptographic signature was finally decoded, it revealed something astonishing, an exact timestamp referencing a specific Soviet weather balloon surveillance mission from 1982. This wasn't just any random date. When researchers dug through declassified archives, they found the referenced balloon flight had captured aerial photographs over a remote barley field, showing a partially formed but strikingly similar circular pattern. That archived image shows a partial match to this crop pattern, suggesting a message or structure evolving across time. This is a 94% pattern match to what we're seeing today, explains one data analyst. It's as if someone began writing this message over 40 years ago and has now completed it. What makes this connection particularly baffling is that quantum computing as we know it didn't exist in 1982. The Soviet Union had no known quantum information program at that time, and the mathematical concepts needed to create such an encoding weren't developed until decades later. This timeline inconsistency has led some researchers to question whether we're dealing with something that transcends our conventional understanding of technological development. If you find these revelations interesting, don't forget to subscribe. Could this be evidence of a long-term communication attempt that predates our mainstream understanding of quantum information science? Or is there another explanation for this apparent temporal connection? After weeks of intensive analysis, a team of quantum physicists and mathematicians has proposed a theory that reframes our entire understanding of this phenomenon. This may not be a message at all, it could be a quantum processor layout mapped onto Earth. 
Mathematicians have demonstrated that the full crop circle matches a working structure used in quantum computation based on braid theory. Specifically, a topological quantum computing model that uses non-abelian anions to manipulate quantum information. What we're seeing resembles a quantum circuit diagram stretched across an entire field, explains Dr. Emily Carter, a leading quantum information theorist. The nested, self-similar loops are reminiscent of fractal codes used in data compression, and the alignment of bits suggests intentional encoding. In topological quantum computing, information is stored and manipulated using the spatial arrangement of particles. The crop formation appears to represent this exact principle, but at a macroscopic scale. What if this is not communication, but computation in physical space? This could explain the strange electromagnetic responses and soil anomalies. The entire formation might be functioning as a kind of physical quantum circuit, using the Earth itself as a computing substrate. It's not just a crop circle. It could be the first known analog to quantum interface, and it's just sitting in a field. This theory aligns with cutting-edge research at Microsoft and other quantum computing labs, where scientists are developing topological qubits and other robust quantum hardware to protect information from decoherence. If true, this discovery represents an unprecedented leap in our understanding of how quantum information could be encoded in physical space, potentially bridging the gap between quantum and classical systems in ways we've only theorized until now. Just as researchers were processing these findings, satellite data detected something that could take this mystery to a global scale. A classified satellite has pinged a new thermal anomaly across the planet near the Nazca Lines in Peru, just 12 hours after the English crop circle was first documented. This new anomaly shows similar thermal and electromagnetic signatures to the original site, but with a different geometric pattern that appears to complement the English formation. Could we be witnessing a planetary chain of quantum beacons? The location isn't random, the Nazca Lines, ancient geoglyphs etched into the Peruvian desert have long puzzled archaeologists with their massive scale and precise astronomical alignments. Now, a new pattern appears to be forming near these ancient markings, suggesting a connection across continents and possibly across time. If one quantum-encoded pattern can function as a physical computing interface, what happens when multiple sites activate in sequence? Could they form a distributed quantum network spanning the globe? And if so, what happens when we connect them? Are we witnessing the awakening of an ancient system designed to process information in ways we're only beginning to understand? If you found this discovery fascinating, you won't want to miss our next video, where we'll examine the Peru anomaly and its connections to ancient sites around the world. Subscribe and turn on notifications so you're always the first to know. As scientists continue to monitor these unprecedented phenomena, one thing becomes clear. We may be at the threshold of understanding a new form of information processing, one that bridges quantum principles with physical reality in ways we never imagined possible. And remember, truth often hides in the patterns. Keep watching.